I believe sincerely that supporting the government is still the best thing to do if you're a Filipino. But trusting Lenny Robredo to even enter the office of the DSWD is not just atrocious, but a direct insult. Because we all know that for the last, what, six years, her every move had always been to destabilize the previous government. And for her to even be allowed to enter the DSWD office is a blatant slap to the face of every single Filipino that loves this country the right way has, and has served it without even having a position in government. I mean, yeah, I know that we need to, you know, unify from the last elections, but <laughs> trusting a wolf in sheep's clothing isn't the way to go. How can this person understand welfare when she doesn't even know how many islands to serve? Hmm? When she can't even tell the difference between association and organization. How can someone now suddenly want to be one with the government if all she has done in the last six years is an attempt to destabilize it? Para sa akin kasi. I promise na ayoko na magmaldita. But when I see an atrocious thing happening and an insult to me, masakit. Personal ang atake sa akin. How can somebody who only ever comes to the ground with more cameras than Ayuda be more trustworthy than somebody, yes, without a position in government or history in ever being part of government, but have most certainly helped more Filipinos without cameras than somebody who has more cameramen on her team than actual workers. Wala lang. I really don't want to say anything because I don't want to seem bitter for not getting a job that I've wanted and dreamt of. A job that I've wanted because I've earned it. But then again, that's Philippine governance and politics. I shouldn't expect any anything more. Thank you nga hindi pa mabigay. Trabaho pa kayang maayos. But in any case, please, never, ever, ever, ever trust somebody like that. Ingat! Mwah.